Hi, I'm Kai Kunkel, and I work with students in schools all around Seattle. I feel glad to get to talk to you right now, especially because we are going to talk about the things that you are really good at doing. All people, adults and kids, do all sorts of things each day. Playing, cleaning up, reading books, and talking with the people around us. Some of those things feel easy for us, and some feel more difficult. The things that are easy for one person might be challenging or difficult for another person. For me, dancing feels fun and easy. Reading is more challenging for me. It's taken a lot of practice for me to feel happy when I'm reading a book. I wonder what things you do that feel easy and fun for you. Saying what you're good at can help you feel proud of who you are and thankful for the chances to get to do those things. In just a minute, we're gonna say one thing that we are good at, but before we do, let's make a list of the things that kids can do really well. I've seen kids who can sing and build things, who help with the housework or tell funny stories. Kids who can focus on one thing like coloring a picture until it's finished. Kids who are kind to the people around them, Kids who can run and jump and kick a ball. Kids who can take care of animals well. And kids who like numbers and solving math problems. Kids who create beautiful art. And kids who have fantastic imaginations. You might specialize in one of those things. Or maybe you're good at something else. A thing you're good at is called a strength. One of my eight-year-old son's strengths is throwing a ball. Now is the time to think of one of your strengths. If you can, stand up with me. And if you want to, reach your arms up high. Take a breath. And think about one of your strengths. On three, say it out loud. Ready? One, two, three. I feel happy thinking about you saying your strength out loud. Thank you for sharing your strengths. I'll see you again soon in another video.